Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So we're about to take up our Symbiote Supreme. He is currently ranked 3 as you can see, and I have just enough resources to rank him up to 4. I actually used up some glory to get the T4 basic catalyst and the T1 alphas that I needed. Uh, this is part of a prep for going into 6.2.6 .6. so let's go ahead and rank him up and we're also going to awaken him and take a look at his signature ability so here we go and he is my latest rank 4 and I don't think I have enough mystic catalyst I mean uh, ISO to take him all the way up so we're gonna end up having to use uh, off color ISO and I'm just gonna grab whatever is up there I've been ranking up uh, mystic champions uh, recently so used up the ISO but in any case uh, I am planning on taking him into uh, act 6.2.6 .6, and we're gonna use him against the champion boss he seems to be the best for at least the first 90% of the champion's health. And I have seen people do the entire fight with him. Although I have another solution for the last 10%. Uh, I wanted to take him up to rank 5 before I went in there, but I may not. I may go ahead and just use him uh, at rank four he seems to be quite quite good anyway all right let's uh grab some of this uh mutant which we have plenty of and i just got sunspot and i was going to also rank up colossus but that's going to have to wait a little bit now so i don't have the resources uh but in any case yeah he he seems to be the easiest uh, against the champion uh, that I saw. All right. Well, I want to use all of those. Let's see, do we got anybody else? Man, got a lot of the. Um, may as well keep using these. Uh, we have a lot of the generics, just the little ones. I'm gonna have to sell those. Let's see, that should be enough. There we go. Perfect. All right, didn't do the uh, network issue thing. All right, so as you can see, I'm not really close to taking him to rank five. I've got the Mystic Catalyst, no problem. Uh, I've got the T5 Basics. I can get the T1 Alphas, but it's those T2 Alphas right now. And of course, I still want to rank up the other guys too. Sunspot, Colossus. All right, let's um, take a look at him real quick here. Take a look at his attributes. See his tags. Switch over to percentages. All right, and we're not going to do any kind of in-depth. We're just going to take a look at them. He has some decent synergies. Uh, if you want to see a more in-depth look, I did make a video a while ago a closer look video on him uh, didn't mean to go out all right so let's go over here and uh, you can take a look at his abilities and we'll awaken him uh, after this and like I said I did make a video so if you want more information more in-depth information uh, definitely check that video out just do a search for symbiote supreme on my channel and it should show up closer look of him all right now he does not need to be awakened first of all uh, I used to think he did but he doesn't all right so we've got two mystic awakening gems thanks kabam so let's go ahead and use that on him all right so let's take a look at his signature ability and why I say he does not need to be awakened so what this does is it puts a stagger on your opponent that lasts for 10 seconds 
That's it. All right. Now, it periodically places this stagger. So why is that important? And why did I awaken him? And I'm going to put some six stones into him uh, for facing the champion. Uh, he will place staggers on his hits. But if the RNG is not with you, that's random. It's not guaranteed that he's going to place a stagger. So if you get very unlucky and you don't get a stagger when you needed it and he gets the buff, then you could be in trouble. But with this, it's added uh, security. All right, you're going to put a, a, a stagger on them. Uh, for level one, every 19 seconds, at uh, max level, uh, SIG 200, it's 10 every 10 seconds. So basically, you're just going to keep that stagger on. So let's go ahead and oops, um, use these. These are what I was going to use on him anyway. Uh, he is great for prestige. So that's another reason to do that. Let's take a look real quick. We just put three in there. Okay, 18.39. Let's, uh, we're not going to do any of the generics. And I'm just going to do 100. Makes it easy. Or 1,000. Doesn't matter. Uh, 58. And it's not doing anything. There. I'll bet you there's the network issues. You see that? That looks new. Okay, there we go. Um, I'm used to seeing the message, but I just saw that glowing thing. I just uh, updated, so this is new. All right. So every 14 seconds. So that's not bad. Uh, that means you only have about four seconds in between staggers where it won't put it up. But you, if you fight aggressively, you're not going to have a problem uh, unless you get very, very unlucky. And I mean very unlucky. All right, um, now let's do a little gameplay so we can show him off and see what he can do. So before we get to the gameplay, I wanted to show you the mastery build that I'm using uh, for this purpose here. Uh, it's not my normal build, but this is the build that I'm using uh, just to showcase Symbiote Supreme. So I don't have any of my suicides turned on. I maxed out deep wounds. I don't have maxed out despair. It's not going to play a factor in the uh, gameplay. And I have one point in assassin. All right, standard on the left there. And one point in willpower. I like putting at least one point in willpower, even if I do not uh, run the suicide masteries. And finally, I put those points in limber because I needed that many in order to get to the Mystic Dispersion. And as you can see, I have three. That seems to be the sweet spot. Some people like four. Most say five is a bit too much. But three seem to be the one that I like the most. All right, so let's go ahead and take him in. And I found a fight. It wasn't easy to find a good fight for him because he excels against champions that have a lot of buffs and we wanted to find one that was you know kind of beefy so that he wasn't uh so easy to uh take down and i believe the variant three chapter three final quest uh has a venom right off to the right here so he's very easy to get to and he's pretty uh stacked so let's take a look at his buffs here. Okay, so he's got nice big buffy health. Apex manufacture. So he's going to be getting these charges at twice the normal rate. Okay, now tech, if you're not a tech, you have your base attack reduced by 50%. So remember that. Um, so his attack is being reduced by 50%. And then you have this combo party. All right. So let's go ahead. He has class advantage. 
So let's go ahead and dive in and see what Symbiote Supreme can do to this Venom. Okay. Just keep in mind his damage is not going to look too impressive right now. It is cut in half, so that should give us a nice uh, uh, long fight here. See how he's gaining power. So you want to get to his special three. There we go. He had 100 genetic potential. So that's when you want to do it. You'll get a nice big uh, power boost after this. So watch his power bar. Okay, look at that power that he got. And now look at his damage. Look at that uh, those bleeds. Okay, see if we can... Uh, don't really want to deal with his special two. But we might have to. All right, there we go. And there we go. We're right at another special three. And that is pretty much how you do it. Keep in mind, his damage is halved. Oops, messed up. And that's going to do it. Yeah, I'm not going to be able to do much here. Let's see. There we go. 100 genetic potential. Yeah, messing up like that really hurt. Let's see if we can get him to throw that special one. go come on play your special one all right get another special three on him hopefully you guys can see the power of symbiote supreme even though I messed up Look at that damage. Come on. See if we can get him to fire off that special one. Yeah, we can't keep taking those uh, parries. Come on. There we go. Another special three. Yeah, Mystic Dispersion. Very, very nice. Okay. Okay, there we go. Scoosh, scoosh. Room. There we go. Sloppy as anything, but he still took him down. All right. So that is Symbiote Supreme. Let's see if we can find another fight. All right, so let's go back in here for another fight. And this time, we're gonna go up and we're gonna fight that Civil Warrior. He has some buffs on his special one. He gets a lot of armor up buffs. So he can be fun. And uh, let's take a look at his buffs real quick. So. We don't want to hit into his block because of explosive personality. And then the rest are the globals. Uh, so, Symbiote Supreme has his damage cut in half because he's not tech, thanks to the global. Alright. So, let's go ahead and see if we can get a parry. Alright. And again, I'm running MD3. We've got one stagger on him. That's nice. He gets a lot more uh, buffs. Now we got more staggers. All right. There we go. All of them nullified. We had 100 genetic potential. Perfect time.
for a special three. Now we have all of the phases activated at once. So we want to go to town. Look at all them bleeds. Mm -hmm. Yeah, buddy. Another special two. Got some nice armor breaks on him. Okay, slow it down. All right. Did not want to accidentally push him to a special three. All right. All right, let's uh, get it. There we go. Wait for that 100 genetic potential. 75. Uh-oh, back to zero. We don't want that. All right, there we go. 100 uh, genetic potential. Accidentally hit into his block, which we don't want to do. But he's already less than 50%. Uh, and remember, his damage is cut in half. So had it been his regular attack, he'd be dead by now. All right. There we go. Let's see how quick we got to another special three. Thanks to uh, Mystic Dispersion. Now we can go back in. All right. Yeah, come on. There we go. Seem to want to throw his specials very often. Come on. Yeah. He's being real coy with them specials. Come on. There we go. Not sure why he didn't uh, dash at him, but it's all good. Now we just need to wait for that genetic potential. There we go. Fire off that special three again. That's pretty much what you gotta do. Just cycle those special threes. Yeah, I don't know why. There we go. Parries are not uh, working, so I'm taking a lot more block damage than I really want to. Okay. Got 100 genetic potential, and he was nice and threw his special this time, instead of making me uh, bait it out for so long. There we go. Oh, tried to catch me coming in. And that's it. All right, guys, that's going to do it. Hopefully you can see the power of Symbiote Supreme, and keep in mind, his damage was cut in half for these fights. So... Uh, that's going to do it. Take care. Click like, subscribe, leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. And you all have a blessed day.